So, everybody's wanting to get rich really, really quick in Monster Squad, and there's a couple of really easy ways to do that. Follow this guide and you'll be making millions in no time. There are two big ways to make money in Monster Squad. One is with the raid dungeons you're allowed to do every day. And for money making purposes, I would recommend going on and doing Mansion of Madness. You're given one key every day to do a raid and Mansion of Madness is the easiest raid to do. You can finish it very fast. A team of just very high attackers can finish it fairly, fairly easily. And the raids net you about 130 to 150,000 gold depending on how far you get. If you manage to finish the whole raid, you're going to be looking at about 150,000 gold as your reward. That's fantastic. That is per day, you know? You do that about 7, 8 days, you're at a million gold already. The second way to make gold really fast in Monster Squad is actually with the Treasure Island dungeon. And this actually takes the energy you get in the game to do. Now, if you've been saving energy like I mentioned in all my other videos in your little notification bar, then you can go ahead and redeem all of those. Hopefully you've got maybe 400, 500 energy saved up for yourself and you can go ahead into the Treasure Island dungeons. These are special dungeons that show up in random times of the week. Usually it's on a weekend, but sometimes it's on a different day. You can go on facebook.com slash monster squad and check on their updates. They always post an update calendar for you with events for the rest of the week. And you can find out which day the Treasure Island dungeon is going to be open and prepare mentally, you know, and hopefully you've already got a good team or if not, you can prepare that as well. And when that dungeon comes out, you can go ahead and dump all your energy into the hardest dungeon you can do and get a ton of cash. If you do go ahead and do the Treasure Island on easy mode, it costs about five energy to do and you're going to get about 3000 gold as a reward. The second tier hard uh, normal mode is going to be 10 energy, but that one only gives you a reward of about 7000 gold. The best one to do is actually the hard version of Treasure Island, which is 15 energy, but it nets you 15,000 gold, which is about 1000 gold per energy. And that is much better than the other ones. Now, it is a little bit tougher to do, but if you've got a team that can manage to do most of the other hard mode story mode dungeons, and if you can finish the raid on a daily basis, you've definitely got a team that can go ahead and do Treasure Island. And as long as you do that, save your energy, dump all your energy in a Treasure Island, you're going to be netting about a million gold every time the event comes out. So, you know, seven days, you if you do the raid seven days a week, you're going to get about a million gold from doing that. And then if you've been hoarding your energy throughout the week, you're going to get another million every week whenever the Treasure Island dungeon shows up, netting you about two million gold a week. And I mean... If 2 million gold a week isn't enough for you, then man, you need uh, you, you need some help. And getting gold is really that simple in this game, guys. Thanks for watching. Leave a comment, like, and subscribe if you enjoyed. And feel free to leave any suggestions in the comments below. See you guys next time.